Well, I'm going to do this large composite now. I'll show you on screen of the uh, interior of a traditional older racing yacht, ocean racing yacht. It's a big craft, wooden craft, which has been refitted inside. I found the um, perspective very interesting in it with uh, all the ribs showing and as the floorboards are up and so on to the bilges and uh, the cabin top being just suspended above at the moment whilst they work on the decks and so on. And I think there's some lovely textures and subtle colours in this which are rather nice to try and do. It's a very large canvas for it but I'll give it a go and see what happens. So the previous ones, this were complicated for drawing in perspective. How about this one? It certainly has taken some working out. It's going to be interesting to paint, but it's going to take quite a while to build it all up, keep a coherent, not make it to separate uh, forms. So, what a nice overall light. So, I'll probably start with the sponge roller as usual and work up my slabs of paint afterwards.
Well, the battery died before I got this far last time. We just got past the sponge roll and into putting some of the base colours on with the flat brush, continuing on with the flat brush now as well, trying to slab paint on and gradually build these colours up.
Well, I'm coming down to the details now. If you see, I put in many of the ropes and, and little details with plug sockets and things. What I want to do now, though, is work in the figures. So, using this particular picture now, I can build up a bit more of the detail onto these figures the forward one here, the one behind. And then uh, I hope to slab in a few more of the stronger colours again, but this is an area that I want to concentrate on right now. Well, before I do the figures, I just want to go back over the chain work here and use some black, because I've got to the stage now where I can use darker colours, and I want to bring out these blacks just a little bit more on this than these chains here. bit. I'll try and do it in a few brush marks. Keep it fairly simple. I don't want this part to become too detailed and therefore be like it's stunning like a <coughs> sore thumb. And with a few brush strokes try and accomplish an impression of them there. I think that painting has just sort of evolved into where it is and it's not going to go much further. I think I'll finish at that and look at it a bit later and see what I feel.